Good afternoon, everyone. Thanks so much for joining us for at 4. I'm Christy Casciano. Well, this should make the kids happy. Governor Andrew Cuomo is looking to reopen more of New York in a fun way today. Jeff Kulikowski has more on this story. And we're also looking down the road, and this will make the parents happy, too, with summer camps. Yeah, believe it or not, I know it's February, but this is the time, right, Christy? You're a parent, I am, too, that, that families really start to look at summer camp planning. Now, the governor today giving a general nod that he believes they can happen this summer. But well before that, he's ready to allow families to go have some fun, if they want, as early as next month. Let's look forward a little bit to some warm weather and some amusement. First up, indoor entertainment centers and places of amusement can reopen beginning Friday, March 26th at 25% capacity and these COVID safety protocols. All facilities must submit reopening plans with health protocols to the local health department. Face coverings and social distancing will be required for all customers and staff, and customers will be required to have a health screening with temperature checks prior to entry. Same rules apply for outdoor amusement parks, which can open with a 33% capacity limit beginning Friday, April 9. Whether indoor or outdoor, there are additional guidelines that include frequently cleaning high-touch areas, attractions, and rides throughout the day. There must be sufficient staff to enforce compliance with rules, including capacity, distancing, and face coverings. Tickets should be sold in advance, and entry, exit, and waiting times should be staggered to avoid congestion. Additionally, day and overnight summer camps in New York State can begin to plan for reopening. Uh, that doesn't happen until June, and we hope... The current trajectory stays until June, one eye on these variants of interest, uh, but they can plan on reopening. I think plan being the key word there, but the governor says they're going to have to have a testing protocol in place, and Department of Health will be issuing specific reopening guidance for camps, including details on timing coming up in the next few weeks. Chris